Hello everyone and after a long time we are back with another Rario preview. This is to look at the ILT20 that's going to be starting from tomorrow and there are a few pack and pick drops happening in the next few hours. So do watch out for that and if you're new to this content, watching Rario content on this channel for the first time, ensure you sign up from the link in the description. You'll get a $20 to start and apart from that we've also attached some links for you to understand more about the concept. We have Nikhil Bhai with us today who will give you more insights on who will be his topics as far as this tournament is concerned. Yes, firstly, a few uh, timely reminders of spoilers. Rario, long-term investment ka something hai. So, up immediate returns mil sakte hain. Aap kalag vidhen sir jaisa ho, to kaafi jaldi mil jayenge. Par mere jaisa ho, to thora rukna bhi padega. To wo dhyan mein rakke invest karein. Pura system dekhein, kya hai, kya nahi hai, kaisa hai, kya nahi. Sab kuch dekhe, aur uske baad faisla le. The reason for saying that is there are too many games that are happening. If I have an issue that I can follow all the games in the game, sab ke follow kar kya, to it is very important to pick and choose and buy packs or picks of that particular tournament where you know that you will play all games. So that the card is also used to be full use ho, aur aapko bhi aisa that card that I have taken will also work in other tournaments. Mein bhi kaam वैसे you can always make your arrangements और क्योंकि ये नया tournament है तो हमेशा ऐसा लगता है कि this is the best chance to see if it works out for you and of course हम picks share करेंगे आपके साथ एक दो एक दो from every team so that you can maybe figure out a way कि okay if we can use them in more places then nothing like it Yes, absolutely. Do watch out and keep in mind, like Nikhil Bhai said, it's an asset yield model. It will take some time for you mm-hmm. to get returns. It's not like uh, daily fantasy where in four or five hours you get your return. It's more of if the because the main fact being that when you buy these cards, they stay with you forever. You can keep using them game after game. Mm-hmm. And hence, it will take you some time for to get that mm-hmm. return back. Hence, keep that patience point in mind. And if you're ready to have that patience and be in it for the long term, then it's a good option for you. And like I already mentioned, the link is in the description for you to sign up. So go explore and understand every facet of it. And as far as reward pools are concerned, we are covering the ILT20. It has the biggest reward pools from all the tournaments yes. that are currently running. So something for you to watch out for. And like you can see on your screen currently, this is the bronze contest. About one, five, four, five teams have currently joined in. And like you can see, there are rewards to be won right up till the 3000th rank. So practically, even if double the people go on and join in yet, you'll still get a certain amount of rewards, even if you have an 80-90% of uh, winning chance, which is yet good enough because the card still stays with you to play in the next game and the game after that and so on and so forth. And like Rario has also intimated to the many of us that the key tournaments like the World Cups and like the IPLs is where you might see those reward pools going even higher. So make sure you get those kind of cards that you can use in these key tournaments and build their XP. Because when the time comes and you have those full XP mm-hmm. cards, that's when you'll be able to even capitalize on the big prizes and till then be able to build onto that momentum with these smaller prizes and get the cards that you want to. So yes, these are the reward pools that are there. This is the bronze contest. Same way if you see in the silver contest, about 500 have joined, but there are rewards up till the 900th rank and so on and so forth for the gold and the black contest too, where currently only half the joining of what the rewards actually on offer are. So make sure that you sign up and get the cards of your choice to be able to participate. And now let's look at what we have in terms of the players who are going to be on offer. Keep in mind that the first thing is the pack drop that's going to happen at 8 p.m. This is for all the yeah. six teams. And then at 9 p.m. there'll be a picks drop of specific cards from the specific teams. Nikhil Bhai, tell us your thoughts when we look at the team Abu Dhabi. Who are your top picks and who are the guys that you're really watching out for? Yeah, I think there are kafi sare options here. Aapke bas. Again, one more thing to keep in mind. A lot of these players might be to and fro from other leagues. So, Track karein, aapka player jis pe aap invest kar rahe, so that you are able to get good returns from that. So, I am sure the first name will definitely be taken by uh, Viren sir for sure. Because he is one of his favorites. But uh, I think I will still take Andrew Russell in that sense. Because the role is like that. Abu Dhabi T10 is now playing. He just played this a uh, few months back. So, fresh off that, I think it is a card that you can use in every tournament. Ho. So, people like him... Uh, you have King as well who's getting decent games. Ingram Zada Nick Hill Rebel Lahiru Kumara once the series is done, maybe he'll play there. So keep a track of those players and then invest on those so that you can do it. 
Yes, absolutely. And Nikhil Bhai guessed it correctly. My pick from here is Akil Hussain from Team Abu Dhabi. I have a 45% XP card of his, a gold card already. So I have no hesitation on why he is my first pick. Then we look at Team Desert. And uh, Nikhil Bhai, what are your thoughts? Who is the pick from this one for you? Desert actually is a desert in terms of the options <laughs> that they have. But uh, again, this league is going to be about who you pick as, as, a, as a combination. अब क्योंकि मेरे पास कॉटरल सर के तीन चार कार्ड है तो मैं आई एम नॉट आई एम नॉट लुकिंग टू फार अवे फ्रॉम हिम यस वेरी फेयर ही विल बोल सम इंपॉर्टेंट ओवर सो गुड चांस दैट दैट वन थ्री विकेट परफॉर्मेंस कम्स अराउंड द कॉर्नर माय पिक फॉर दिस वन इज वरिंदो हसरंगा अगेन अ कार्ड दैट आई ऑलरेडी ओन एंड अ कार्ड हु आई एक्सपेक्ट अ लॉट ऑफ वन सीज बैक फ्रॉम द इंडिया सीरीज देन वी लुक एट द नेक्स्ट टीम हियर वी हैव टीम अबू धाबी निखिल भाई हु इज योर कॉल फ्रॉम दिस वन Team, they go. I think they have actually they have good enough players who've been playing a lot of T20, T10 cricket. There is great option in Rahman Powell because he's not playing anything else and he's hmm. making it a habit. There is Isro Dana, Muzibur Rahman. So, coffee options there. Have you? Even I'm I'll, I'm keeping the two names for him to say. But Zazai Sab ka bhi ek din aata hai. So, agar aap usko right day pe pick kar lete ho, so then also he can give you your uh, he can give you good returns. Yes, absolutely. All the big names, the guys who, when they come off, they'll push you straight to rank one. My picks from this one: Sikandar Raza, Fabian Ali, and both are top choices, especially in Dubai conditions. And like I always say, the guy to watch out for Chamika. Again, I have a gold card of him at about 33% XP. So again, he'll be a card for me to watch out for in this series too. Then when we go on to Team Gulf, Nikhil Bhai, who is your special one from here? हाँ गर्ल्स में अब देखो मुझे लगता है ज्यादा बैटिंग ऑप्शंस हैं एज अपोज टू मोर ऑलराउंडर ऑप्शंस तो एक जिस पे कर्जर है वो तो मुझे गिवन है कि वो तो आप ही ले लोगे तो आई एम स्टिल गोइंग विद अ बैटर ऑप्शन इन शिमरन हेटमायर अगेन आई हु कैन क्रिएट मेक एन इम्पैक्ट क्योंकि वो जैसे बैटिंग करते हैं इज लुकिंग फॉर दो बाउंड्रीज सो दैट इज ऑलवेज हैंडी एंड अगेन आई एम ट्राइंग टू गो विद गाइज वी बोथ आर एक्चुअली जो ज्यादा लीग्स में खेलते हैं so that you are able hmm. to use them at other places as well so i think Absolutely. somebody like a shemran hetman of if gleason is fit if usually is also a great pick dawson in this conditions could be handy as well and jimmy hmm. overton has a few good knocks in t10 so again these are all experiences of the past that are helping me take a call here so iske liye main kehta hu pick or choose kare apni games and then you can invest on them Yes, absolutely. Very fair call. Shimran will be one to watch out for when the Indian T20 League comes about too. My pick from this section is David Visa. Again, he is Kolkata's backup all-rounder. And as far as I see, from all the all-rounders that mm-hmm. are present here, along with maybe Dominic Drakes, he'll be the key one. But Drakes has not had too much of recent form, so hence I'm backing David Visa here. Then when we move to Team Emirates, Nikhil Bai, who is your pick from this one to end it? One name is screaming in my eyes. Pick me, pick me, and I've done that all my life. Whenever he's played, that is Fazal Faruqi. And because uh, again, they go. I'm trying to go with guys who bowl up top and at the bottom because that is something that I'm very comfortable doing. It can be different for you. In sabi ki injury status, please check karna so that ap aisa na ho ki ap galat uh, player pe back karke baithe ho and turns hmm. out the guy is not quite fit. So, wo sab dekh ke you can definitely invest on some like a Faruqi. There is also, if if I read it right, there was a Zadran there, which is also a very good pick for me because he always benefits me when he is batting first. So again, these are all picks that work for me, and I have some of their cards, so always handy. Yes, I'm glad he didn't pick Puran from this section. My <laughs> pick from this one is uh, Trent Bolt, so I'm accompanying Fazal Haq to open the bowling well with Trent Bolt. and while we talk about lot of spin in these conditions keep in mind that many of these batters will have face a challenge when they face trent bolt on a fresh pitch so he can be a good challenging task for them up top and last team for us is team sharja nikhil bhai i already have a black card from the section so you can't pick him tell us your other pick <laughs> so i'll go with uh, navinil ak firstly because again uh, a guy who plays around the globe uh, may not play in australia and as he tweeted so let's see how that goes but again may ek aur end overs bowlers ke sath ja raha hu i think hmm. local agar aapko koi chahiye yahan pe jinko aapko punt lena hai to kartik mayapan we saw what he did in the world cup so he could be a very interesting pick 
if I, if we can uh, confirm i think one local player is what is a mandate yeah. so that yeah. is something that could be the differential third pick jo aap team bana rahe ho team ki usme aapka ek player waisa ho agar aur us din chal jaye to fir uh, you, you should get a good rank there so yes go with what you yes, feel absolutely like. that should be the case my pick from this one is my pure black card ownership Nabi. in moin ali so <laughs> no doubt i am going to back him but i think one other guy who you can watch out for especially if he plays in pur ahmed because yeah. uh, his mystery will rattle many batters out there especially when he's bowling in that middle and death part because we have yeah. seen him bowl uh, towards the end of the middle overs he bowls somewhere around 11 to 15 so that ca- especially in a pressure chase he will be of good use to you there so do try him out mm-hmm. at times when he bowls second and that wraps up our picks from all the teams we hope all of you go and make some amazing picks to back who you feel yeah. will work and make your picks at 9 pm but before that don't forget that buy your packs at 8 pm too the link yeah. is in the description and for people who already have cards and have already been playing leagues make sure that you use your higher xp cards because they'll come up good use to you here yes bilkul make sure you use participate in as many games kyunki ek free agar koi issue hai rare you in any sense then please go to the website mail to the support raise a ticket and hopefully it should get resolved in time good luck yes absolutely have a good tournament and all the good luck to you